Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today's video there will be a quick review of app sheet for beginners. We'll take a look at its features, how to create an app with app sheet. We'll take a look at the prices and also templates we can use it to create like the new app. So as you can see, they provide us the opportunity to build a no code mobile and web apps with app sheet. So nothing hard. Um, there are like seven steps we need to follow to create an app. And all of them were described on their main uh, website. So firstly, we just simply need to prepare our data open the spreadsheet or database you'd like to use for an app. App sheet lets you choose from an array of data sources like Google Sheets, Excel, Cloud SQL and more to make sure App sheet can read your data appropriately. Um, set up your data with a column header in the first row and rows of data underneath. If you'd like, you can also start from a pre-built app template. We'll explain, we'll show them a little bit later. Then we need to connect our data to AppSheet. So AppSheet never hosts your data, but interacts uh, with it based on how you set up your app. You can connect data to AppSheet in a couple ways. So here we can find the option, just simply add it through the apps page. Uh, then we need to uh, familiarize yourself with the AppSheet editor. So you are now in the AppSheet editor we'll also find it a little bit later and uh, then we just simply need to start our customizing. So as you can see, uh, they have like a small tutorial. I'll show you the same. So define how you connect data will be used before you build your app interface. You will need, you will want to specify how your data is being used in the data tab. Add additional tables to your app by going to data then tables. So yeah, we'll see it. Uh, create videos, uh, create views and customize look and feel. So AppSheet makes it easy to create and customize views by providing ready to use view types that you can customize. To create a view, go to the UX type, also we'll show it. And basically then we need to create a bot to run automation. AppSheet makes it easy for anyone to automate their work by creating boots. Every boot will have three components and even task and processes. So in the last step, test, share and deploy your app with users. So whenever you're ready, you can easily share your app with others to test it. Go to the users tab in the users section and then just simply share it. And now our app was really really easy created as you can see nothing hard so let's go to our personal account uh, dashboard uh, you can create it with the help of different types of accounts google microsoft apple and so on and you'll come to this page where we have a couple of sub pages so firstly we can find a shared with you apps owned by you we can find all the templates we can use and also we can create a new one if we'll click on this icon in the left corner so let's click on plus and let's start from creating app uh, we can create with existing data or start with a template or we can create a blank app and also we have the option to manage our databases we can create a new one or import from sheets. So firstly, of course, to prepare to create your app, you need to create your own um, database or sheet with some information. So we can click on import and then just import it. Then we are ready to interact with app. So let's start from uh, with a template just as for an example to show you all the features. Uh, here we need to select the necessary one. So explore a library of common app use cases that can be copied and customized or referenced as inspiration for your specific project. There are a lot of different templates, simple survey, simple inventory, Kanban board, project tracker, sheet management, order deliveries. So maybe like 50 or even more different options we can use journal, workspace safety and so on. Just uh, a lot, a lot of different things, even CRM template we have here. So let's click uh, for example for 
uh, journal, I'd like to find it somewhere here, I guess. Uh, let it be like journaling app we are going to create with no code so yeah like this let's click on explore to see what's inside of this template it may take a little time and as you can see we can find how will it look like so syncing the app and as you can see we have a lot of uh, different pages we can click on every single page, add a title, date, time, and it's pretty cool. So I think that it could be really good. We can click on plus, add new, add date, time, mood, title, activities. I think this app is quite good. So let's click on copy and customize now. Or we can click on look under the hood to see um, what's inside to see some structure or something else and here on this page we can explore app um, apply team and so on in the left side we have this data if you click on it we can see the name type key label so this is a way of how it was like created as the database like also like entries moods so where can we find all the information here uh, we can also interact with the uh, content in the right side let's go to views to see how will it look like as for views actions boots so as you can see nothing hard uh, just simply open and then uh, explore it by yourself if you'll click on any single object, we can click on edit on this pen icon. We can edit settings uh, here and then just manage the type options. And also we can do some other things. And this is a way of how to interact with the templates. Let's now see the prices here for this app. And as you can see, we have a starter plan and core five and done dollars per month. Prices are not really high. We can start to use it for free and then just simply upgrade it. We have basic application and automation features, connect to spreadsheet and cloud file storage providers. And there are a lot of other options. You can find all the features right up here. And basically it's really good option to start with no code app building. Uh, so yeah, this is definitely the best way of how to do that uh, after we created our app we can then basically save it and share it to our users to start testing so this was a quick review of app sheet hope this video helped you out leave a like subscribe goodbye